Bonjour, guten Tag, what's up, bruv? Guys, what a beautiful day where there's no time to waste. Guys, start of the week, that means hard work doesn't stop. Today I'm gonna go to the gym, but I have some really exciting news. Yesterday I was contacted by an agent, scout, like I don't I'm not quite sure, but I had a phone call with him for more than two hours and he worked with many many players and he works in the asian area and there's an opportunity and he asked me if i'm really serious about going overseas and i told him bro for a pro contract if i have the opportunity to play pro yeah i would do that there's a serious opportunity in Azerbaijan. The thing is, Azerbaijan is a country that plays football as well, obviously. But am I ready yet to go to Azerbaijan? Azerbaijan, do you guys know how far it is? That would mean that I would be away from my family, from my friends, from all the people that I met here. And this is quite a decision that I really need to make. Brendan, are you really able to go to Azerbaijan and are you ready yet? And I just told him, and because I always try to be honest to myself as well. And by the way, this sunshine, man, is amazing. But am I ready yet? I don't think so. As it's a long time ago that I've played a match that's why and England is still a good country with many, many opportunities. As I told you, there are many, many people now that try to help me behind the scenes. So I was thinking, okay, Azerbaijan is still an option, but what I need to focus on is, as I have a club now and I can't jump from this and that and this and that, no, I need to do one thing straight. So as I have a club now, I need to focus with that club and just playing games and that's it i need to play games and then i have some video footage and everything and the guy he understood me and he said yeah that's really important to play games as football is all about games it's not about training because you improve in games not in training so that's why now all the focus is on that club that i have now and to play games because I can't wait to finally show you guys my highlight videos because I need to prove to many, many people that this guy who talks for over 193 days that he proper can play football. Potatoes with lentils, curry, broccoli, and sell it mm. and what i want to do now is i want to answer more questions because i still get so many messages so one of the common questions are i'm 16 am i too old to be a pro no you're not what should i do if i'm not self-confident you need to train as much as you can because when you train much you're going to get self-confident automatically people say i'm how do, I, how do I handle when people say I'm not good enough? Bruv, in, out, train as hard as you can. Let other people talk because the truth is on the pitch. Guys, you should never let other people define who you are. Did you play for Congo national team? I played for Congo under 17, under 20 national team. Yes. What happened to the earlier years? Why haven't you been a pro yet? To be honest, I don't know, because I played in quite good clubs in my recent years, but why I'm not a pro, I don't know. Maybe it, there must be something I did wrong. Maybe I took some bad decisions. I don't know, to be honest. Who's your favorite player? Thierry Henry always will be my favorite player, but now I think it's 
Paul Pogba. Paul Pogba, those creative players, yeah, Paul Pogba. And last question, how do you stay always positive? What keeps you going? What motivates you? My mom. My mom and I know how life can be if I actually be a pro. Because this will change the lives of many, many in my family. And hard work pays off. Don't let the sun go down on me, girl. So now I'm on my way to the gym as gym needs to be done. Guys, with football, gym is always associated. And man, I love gym, so I'm looking forward to gym. I'm gonna do a quick workout, so let's do it. I started off this gym session with a cycling warm-up because you need to make sure that you always warm up proper because you start lifting weights or do your workout. And then I did five sets of as many pull-ups as I can. And as I haven't been to the gym for a long time, I need to definitely build up my strength again. And then what I always try is when I go to the gym, I try to include more body weight ex exercises because body weight exercises, they're going to help you more on the football pitch. You don't need to be a bodybuilder or something. But still, it doesn't mean you don't have to lift any weight. So if you want to really improve your strength, then include weights as well. And that's what I do. Because I try to do those exercises explosive and to just improve my strength because even as a center back or center forward I can't let defenders or strikers let push me and this exercise I love this one because this one is more also football related as in a football pitch you do a lot of turns so this one will increase your strength and your core and then at the end I did some stability workout as ankle injuries are so common in football so you need to strengthen your ankles so you do this three sets and one set looks like foot forward and then to the side and backwards and then core strengthening exercise three sets and each set is normal plank side plank and then switch to the other side and you do each of those 30 seconds and I'm gonna increase that for one minute but I'm not ready yet so I need to rebuild my strength proper again because one minute to hold it is burner and then just simple core exercises because core one of the most important thing in football you need to have a strong core so others can't push you or bully you and then to just relax my muscles black roll and this relaxes your muscles so good you roll out try to roll out every part of your 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 body and you feel so good after that and don't forget to stretch as well after each workout this will make you more flexible and you just feel so good now as i'm back home and it feels so good to be back in the gym and to do a proper workout but today it was more like a recovery session as I need to relax my muscles but after such a workout what is important proteins so I'm gonna do my protein shake and I think soon I need a new one but guys to tell you as well if you want to get a protein shake or something else from Herbalife you're gonna get 20% off and if you actually just go to the link in my description and you can see all the products that they have. And trust me, 20% is a proper good deal. And I think even me, I need soon a new one. And there are so many flavors and so many nice things. So man, I'm just looking forward to those things. And what I most of the time do, I always blend it now as it's so nice with a banana. And you can blend also with other fruits like maybe strawberries 
or like mango, but this tastes so nice. So after watching some videos of motivation, because that's what I do sometimes. Sometimes when I just need a motivation to just keep doing, it's just watching motivational videos. And there are so many of them. And actually, I'm thinking as well, because the crazy part of this journey is that even me, I don't know where I'm going to be in like after 365 days. This journey is full of surprises full of things that I don't even know and some might say that I already know what's going to happen and this was all filmed before and I know already about the outcome and everything but the thing is I don't know I started to document my journey 190 days ago or 193 or 94 days ago with the belief that I'm gonna be a pro football player and now after 190, more than 190 days, I still don't know what's going to happen. And this is the thing, what is so exciting, that I don't know where I'm going to be in like one, two months. Everything is possible. Because me, I'm the type of guy that I don't care about anything. And I think the guys who are there from the beginning, they know me already that i don't care about anything i'm able to do everything so maybe in two three months i'm gonna be in mexico or tanzania in africa like i don't know because i want to chase that pro contract because i know that it is possible you just need to have the heart and the mindset and the determination because when you compare some football players, they are professional. And when you see them play, like there's nothing that, that they can do better than me. There's nothing that they can do better than me. But somehow they got in and they are professional. And that's what I want. I want to be a professional. No matter how, but I want to be professional. So that's why... I'm able to do everything for this pro contract. And tomorrow I'm going to train again at Arsenal. And this will be a great experience. So that's why training starts at 8 o'clock. So I'm having an early night's sleep. And I just want to say thank you again for all the support. For all the messages that I still receive. For all the comments. And I still read every single comment. And guys, me... I will never let you down guys keep that in mind but anyway i hope you guys enjoyed watching today's video make sure you subscribe if you haven't already smash that like button guys and keep in mind when you believe everything is possible so team brand now mm, i'll see you tomorrow <laughs>